Hi everyone, Mama Mermaid here. I hope everybody's doing great. I thought I would make a little video about revision. I haven't did that in a while. But before I forget, don't let me forget to tell you to please like, share, and subscribe. And uh, if you would like some one-on-one -on -one coaching or some advice on crystals, what crystals would do the best for you, what would help you, then please message me and uh, you can get a hold of me at gymdesign655 at gmail.com and you can also um, try my Marsha's Gym Designs where I have everything. I've got my um, my courses on there. I've got my uh, all my for coaching to call in for the calls to order a call on coaching. And, of course, I have all my beautiful crystal jewelry, which I am hearing more and more success stories about how people love these crystals. I'm telling you, they really work. So, I want to help you any way I can. And, so, let's get on into the video. I want to talk about revision because a lot of times revision are, is still coming up. Revision is changing the past. But the thing about revision is... If you've got some bad memories, uh, even childhood, uh, teenage, you know how you get bullied in school sometimes or somebody picks on you or something like that. If you've got any really bad traumatic memories, you can revise them and, you know, erase them from your mind. And the bad thing about it is if you have them and you don't, then it affects parts all through your life. Your your relationships um, with people, with your brothers and sisters, your parents. It can, it can affect numerous things all through your life if you don't revise these. And it's not really hard to revise them. You're just changing the memory. You're remembering it and then you're cutting out the part that you don't want and you're replacing it with a small 5, 10, no more than 20 second excerpt that will imply that you had things happen the way you wanted them to, not the way they really happened. So you're changing. No matter how bad the situation is, you can revise it. No matter how sad, no matter how terrible it made you feel. And every time you thought about that since then, every time it would pop up in your mind, you know, and it would kind of make you cringe, you need to revise that. You need to revise it because... You know, if you're having trouble with relationships, think back. Did you have somebody that seemed disloyal to you? Uh, that seemed, um, that lied to you? Somebody that lied to you? That can make a big difference. Anything that hurt you. Anything that caused you pain, mental anguish, anguish, anything like that. Revise it and get rid of it. I mean, if it's really bad, I suggest doing the faster EFT tapping. And Sammy has three videos on that, and I'm pretty sure a couple of my videos I have um, did a, a showed you how to do it. So, you know, revision is a wonderful thing, and you can even lay down at night and do and revise the day. The best time to revise something that happened to you that you didn't want to experience is revise it that day, that night, immediately. You know, but for things that happened and you didn't know about revision back in your childhood, and it's a say you're having trouble with relationships. Well, maybe somebody treated you badly back when you were 12 or 13. And yes, that can affect your relationships. You know, so what you do is you, you know, lay down in a quiet place and take some deep breaths, relax, and just think of that incident that happened. And then change it. Come up with a little scenario that totally changed that accident or that incident or that betrayal, whatever it was, like it never happened. But the thing about revision is the older the memory, 
the longer you need to visualize it in your mind over and over and over and over. And it might take you a couple of weeks for a really old memory to subside. If it was a very painful memory like somebody treated you really bad or you had a boyfriend and you caught your best friend with him and that just totally devastated you, uh, that memory would take, I would think about two weeks maybe, maybe longer. What you would do is you would do, you would revise it every night because every time you've thought about that memory, um, you would, you know, you have to do revise it as many times as you've thought about it through your life. So it could be a hundred times. So you want to think about the revision and when you think of the memory, the old memory, it doesn't cause you any pain. You need to revise it till it reaches that point. That's why, like I said, if it's very traumatic, I recommend doing EFT tapping on it first. Um, quite a few times. You know, you're just releasing, let it go, releasing, let it go, releasing, let it go, releasing, let it go. It is gone. Take your deep breath. Peace. And how often do you do that? You do that until the memory from a scale of 1 to 10 is a 1 or a 0. I mean, until it, until when you think of it, it doesn't cause you any pain. It doesn't matter to you anymore. That's how many times you need to tap it out. So, and then it makes the revision very much a lot easier. You know, a lot easier. So, that is my suggestion on that sort of revision. Now, if it's instant revision, you know, if, say, you got a phone call and, uh, say it was your brother. He called and his business is going terrible and he just doesn't know how he's going to keep going with it. Time you get off the phone with him. Revise that his business is flourishing, his business is booming, and just see him in your mind being so happy telling you how everything, he's sold more than he ever thought he would. He's just, you know, doing wonderfully. And then, you know, you probably won't have any trouble revising it right then on the spot. And if it does, if you do think about it later and it causes you some concern or worry, revise it again. Anything that causes you worry and concern or upsets you to think about it, you need to revise it and get it out of your life. And it's not hard to revise. I mean, you can revise every night before you lay down to go to bed. Uh, if you get a chance in the afternoons, lay down and take a nap, you can, you can revise then. And, uh, sorry about that. But revision is very important. It's a wonderful tool. To rid your body and your mind of negative thoughts, negative influences that influence your life today. You want to get that out of the way. You don't want old negative thoughts interfering in your relationships, interfering in your, you know, your day-to-day -day life, upsetting you. So try this revision. I'm telling you, just create a small scene, 10 to 20 seconds at the most, because you're going to see think this over and over and over and over and over you are replacing that old scene so anything anybody said to you anything anything can be revised just think about what you have would rather have happened uh say if you were going on a trip and the trip turned really bad and you remember you know circumstances you know being terrible just imagine you didn't go imagine you did something else Wipe that memory out of your mind and don't let it influence your present state of being. So, and I was thinking, was there anything else I want to talk about? Yes, I will tell you a new, um, there's a new thing that I've been doing. And I think it will help a lot of people. To really, this is my own experience, nobody else's. And it will help you with your SP or... Whatever you need help with. There's a general manifestation that we've kind of got away from. And it's laying down, taking four or five deep breaths. I choose to play um, some boosters from Lucy Herzig. Which is, she's wonderful. And, uh, hold on. So, uh, anyway... 
when you listen to her, you play them at the same time. You lay down, you relax. You get your crystals if you've got them. Hold your crystals in your hands. And just repeat, I am a master at manifestation. I am the best of the best. I am success now. And you can just take those three. And oh, and I, I totally understand manifestation. And usually I will play a booster twice, a video, and then the booster again. And so you're talking about maybe 30 minutes, 40 minutes. Okay, in that time I have seen significant changes of just running those three affirmations over and over and over and over until all three have played through. I have run them through. I'm telling you, you will see a day and night difference in your affirmations and in your results. Your results will absolutely be amazing. And I'm, you know, telling you, it will, it will make such a difference. So, I think that's all I have to talk about for now. I just wanted everybody to be able to manifest their desires. It's time we had all our stuff that we want. It's time for our lives to be the kind of life that we want to live. And so, like I said, just keep watching for new videos. I've just been off for a while. And uh, I've missed everyone. So, y'all just... Keep watching, keep swearing, and keep liking. And we'll have our manifestations. And everybody will have all their dreams. So until next video, see you later.